Hi, my name is David Gans. I'm the executive director of RECOF, the Center for People in Forests. RECOF is an international nonprofit organization based in Bangkok, Thailand. We serve the poorest and most marginalized rural communities in the Asia Pacific region. We help them build their capacity to overcome poverty and protect the forests they depend upon for their survival. Our work lays the foundation for achieving many of the sustainable development goals of the United Nations 2030 Agenda, as well as the Paris Agreement on Climate Change. The novel coronavirus does not differentiate between peoples. It attacks both the rich and the poor. But the communities we serve are far less able to protect themselves from COVID-19 than others, as they have least access to provisions in health care. Globally, we are facing two global crises at the very same time, COVID-19 and climate change. We must fight both at the same time with the same solution. To prevent future pandemics and to stop climate change, we must protect our forests and the people who live in them and near them. Research clearly shows that deforestation spurs transmission and that deforestation also escalates climate change. The health of forests, humans, the planet, and all life are interdependent. As the world fights both crises, there's a risk that governments will establish policies that can marginalize rural people and undermine their land rights, reversing the progress we have made. There's also a risk that the private sector may allocate capital to initiatives that further harm local people. Local communities face a third threat, hunger. We must think beyond the pandemic if we are to innovate in our responses to COVID-19 and climate change, we can address the most persistent and neglected inequalities in the world. At RECOF, we are escalating our work with governments, donors, and the private sector to ensure our collective efforts to prevent pandemics and to combat climate change. We must take into consideration the knowledge and the needs of forest communities, particularly women and marginalized groups. I call on the UN Global Compact to contribute by ensuring responsible investment and helping forest communities to advance their rights and their aspirations. On behalf of RECOF and all of our partners, we wish you and your families health, safety, and stability.